Okay, so hello and welcome everybody. It's currently the 25th of March. It's 7 o'clock and in this video I'm going to be training the legs. So I'm just going to have breakfast now and I have here 200 grams of oats. That's about 900 calories. Then there is some strawberries, sultanas, almond milk, dates. So there's about 11 to 1400 calories in this meal and yeah, I'm going to have this now and then I'm going to be doing deadlifts. So yeah, I'm not sure what rep range I'll be working in. Um, I think I'll probably do like three or four with 12 maybe, because I'm not on a like program at the moment. Um, I'm just trying to try and eat. I'm just trying to try and try and hire that the last time. And yeah, so I saw I need to print myself off a program and go with that, but uh, I'd like to try. Last time I done 160 for like, uh, a few sets of four or six reps so I might throw that on again and see how things go but yeah uh, I'm gonna have this now and then I'll see you in the shed so it's gonna be a good workout I'll see you in a bit Okay, so I just finished that workout there, and I'm now gonna have like three tens of beans. There's some chickpeas there, some black beans, and some mixed beans. Then there's a bit of broccoli I managed yesterday. Just a nice quick meal, and um, cause it's like after 11, so like if I uh, eat too, if I eat too late, like closer to three, then I'd be better off just having like sort of one big meal then because uh, I'd be too full then to have a tour meal if you get me so gonna mill this and then yeah I'm just gonna flake out for a while that's all you need I'm just craving beans at the moment I haven't had lentils in a while I haven't there um I should try meal prepping uh, because I wanna like they're really good for uh getting lean I think if you're eating a lot of like beans, legumes, fiber and all that like uh, and eating like some say under twenty five percent fats, some say twenty percent fats for when you're trying to recomp for um I was just trying to be like intuitively eating the last while. I haven't used my fitness pal in months like uh and I've successfully recomped slightly but I'd like to see how much I could recomp because uh, I'd rather not go in a calorie deficit, even though it like it'd be so much easier to like get dropped away faster. But yeah, no, you don't want to be in a calorie deficit really if you're like, because uh, it's gonna impact your training and your mood and stuff. But yeah, so here's book. What's up, book? How you doing? You well? That's all you want, man. Right, season a bit. Okay, so as well, I got these recovery balls off my protein and I've been using them the last while. So I'm gonna do a giveaway. I have three here and yes, they also do like uh, a recovery stick that has like three of them on it. And that's great as well for getting those different angles. But uh, I suppose like to do the giveaway, what do you do? You like you can follow my Instagram profile, tag three people in a post they're gonna make, and whatever else you're supposed to do in a giveaway. It's uh, that was a sale on, and I got them cheap enough, so like, yeah, just thought it'd be a, a really good, like, so um, hopefully, if you just put them to good use, well, then happy days for everyone. Yeah, you can get them in all different, uh, there's different versions of them and all, so uh, yeah. What does it say on it? Ideal for tight and sore muscles. 
slow and controlled movements. Moving quickly can lead to injury, stop if you feel pain or discomfort worsens. Uh, yeah, it says a few other things, but like, do not throw or bounce the product. The book thinks it's a ball sometimes. Don't you, book? But anyway, yeah, I'll set that post up or whatever and feel free to enter because, yeah, there's three of them, so it depends how many people enter, but you probably have a good chance of winning anyway, so yeah, uh, feel free to tag anyone who you think is like, yeah. Uh, I don't know, I need some recovery. Yeah, no, well anyway, if you've been like lifting weights uh, for a few years, like you definitely have, I'd say a good bit of scar tissue and, uh, scar tissue and, I forget what else, uh, adhesions and stuff built up in your muscles, so like, it's it's pretty intense, like can, you can uh, put a good bit of pressure on, uh, say for your cast for example you can do it with one leg or you can do it with your two legs if you're mad enough you know but uh, yeah it um, definitely really works you can actually feel like your muscle your muscles split whereas before like they're more like one muscle so yeah no they actually are really effective and you can try out different types and stuff but uh yeah, no, they're definitely, they're something I would, if you haven't started using them, you'd be best off trying to, like, use them early on in your training because then you just won't have to undo a lot of, like, the mess you made in the first place, which is sort of, like, the case with me, but, no, I definitely feel, like, uh, like, much more mobile and flexible anyway. They're able to, like, sort of release the muscle in ways that you can't sort of or not that you can't but in different ways to like static stretching for long periods of time if you get me but yeah that's pretty much gonna be it for this video everybody i hope you've enjoyed and yeah feel free to uh, enter into this giveaway and potentially win i'm sure uh I could get loads more again like and do more giveaways because they're actually just that good like that should just get one for everyone so we can all just uh, recover you know so look come here this side probably always running away for you know yeah but anyway that's gonna be it for this video everybody i hope you enjoyed and yeah thanks for watching much love everybody peace see you soon bye bye